Hi, I am going to be doing my first gaming video today. Yay! Um, yeah, I'm not using headphones right now because I can't record with headphones. But, uh, we'll see how this goes. This is, like I said, my first attempt. I'm going to be playing Nightmare Adventures The Witch's Prison. I've already played this game once or three or four times before, but I really enjoyed it, so I will first type in my username, which would be better if I can alter. Do I have to delete or new? I have to do new. Okay, apparently player is set as the first one. There. Okay, so let's just get into the game. You, you're them, aren't you? You needn't worry about us now, Miss Val. We have taken you into protective custody for the time being. Before we can release you, we need to know what you were doing in Blackwater Asylum. We need to know what you remember. Start at the beginning, Miss Vale, and don't leave anything out. I... I guess it started with the letter. I was trying to find information about my birth mother. All I had was the name. Why stick... You. I'm so sorry about that. I received a letter saying that... The family built the asylum and that I owned it now. I just wanted to have a look around the place, see if there were any records about my family, who they were, what they did, that type of thing. I was just looking for some answers. Obviously, I'm so awesome at reading. Would you like to view instructions and tutorial prompts while playing? I've played this game and many others before, so no. Okay. Uh... Down here we have inventory. I'm kind of annoyed because this is an older game. I cannot lock the inventory. Uh, hint button, photos. We will be taking photos throughout. Story. Story so far. Back to one. Uh, Dear Miss Fowl, while conducting my own investigation into the confounded place, I came upon your forum post seeking information about the last name Wisewick. I, I'm just going to be butchering that throughout this whole thing, so don't be surprised. While I'm not a Wistwick myself, I have reason to believe that the Wistwick family built the old Blackwater Asylum in 1810. I've been charged with caring for the asylum grounds for some time, and while I've never been inside the building, I'd be willing to bet you could find some information about your ancestors within the walls. In closer directions to the asylum, stop by whenever and I'll show you around. Alton Quinn I've sorted out the location of that asylum in the letter. I'm going to head over there now and see if I can find any old stuff that might have belonged to my birth parents. According to Quinn, I actually might own the place if I'm the only living relative of the original Wiswicks. And I'm going to be pronouncing that several different ways throughout. Another warning. I've arrived, but the place is all locked up. I think I'll do some snooping anyways and see if I can find my way in. It looks like this place has been abandoned for some time. I guess that makes it more likely that I'll end up owning it. I wonder what land what the land is worth out here. Yeah, uh, I don't know if it's such a good thing to own an asylum. Like, would anyone want to buy it from you because it is an asylum? Missing gears. Can't see inside. Oh wait, there's this time sheet. I can't see. Okay. Quarantine. Contagion. Great. Story. 
There's a sign hanging on the front gate claiming the place is quarantined. It's from 1954, though, so should be safe. Uh, should be safe now, right? I guess there's no sense in being scared of a bug that went around 60 years ago. I'll just have a quick peek and see if Mr. Quinn is around. Yeah, because nothing sketchy about going to an old quarantine asylum. Oh, wait, I have to grab this first. My inventory. Right. Go over here. I'm gonna need the ladder to climb up this tree. And there's, for some reason, a gear among the eggs. Let this cloth because that's the only way I'm gonna be able to clean off this thing. Because you know a dry one wouldn't cut it clean off much better. There's a bun in there. Great, it's clean, but I can't get inside. Okay, I need do I need all the gears to place this? I didn't think I did because what? Okay. Are you just looking? Screwdriver. Okay, screw holding it. Now can I put this in here? I found one gear! I found one gear. Let's find them all though. Okay. It kind of look like a morphing object, but I know this game doesn't have morphing objects. No. Ah, huh, there. Yeah, here we go. No. Maybe. Yeah. And there. Okay. All the line. Please. I should be able to do this. I should be able to do this. And finally we're in. This foul. So nice to me. I'm gonna start that. This foul. So nice to. Oh my god. Why is it with me and voices today? In reading. It's Dale. So nice to see a new face around here. Gets a bit lonely it does. Hello sir. You wrote me to... <laughs> I know English. Hello, sir. You wrote the letter to me, right? About the Black War Asylum? Yep, that was me, Alton Quinn, the groundskeeper at your service. The asylum's just up this road. An odd path, though. Might want to grab some supplies from my place before you head out. I'd show you out there, but, uh, at the moment, I need to tend to the graves and the overgrowth. Perhaps later we can have a sit down about your family. I'd be very. Uh, I'd very much appreciate that. I guess I'll. Okay. You just left me in the middle of a sentence. Cord. Dirt. A fresh grave. Creepy. Yeah. Especially because there is right next to his house. Like, why? Then again, I kind of grew up next to a cemetery, but it wasn't that close to the house. Like, not nearly that close. It was on the other side of a ditch a long ways. I'm not long. I want to stop talking about that now. Okay. Oh yeah, I need the core, don't I? Wait. 
That cord should be something else, is it? I need it. I have the key. Oh yeah, I have the key. But it's like on the inside. So. Inside Quinn's house, I found an envelope. It said, "Fail is number thirteen. Bring her to me." On it, that was enough to warrant a look. And inside was a picture of me from three or four years ago. This Quinn guy was up to something, and I had to find out what it was before he got back. Here it is. Here's what I'm looking for. And I can turn on the lights. So, of course, he's pretty much living in the dark. Some of electricity fills the air. The power is on. Yeah. Got that. Another little lorry to get stuff. Another lorry to get stuff. Pocket knife. Pocket knife might come in handy. We are going to get into the batteries. Little well, battery. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I have to have the remote to turn it on. I'm going to steal battery from the clock. Oh, power. That's a big fish. Oh, oh. Okay, I've, I've seen that before, and I didn't get it. It's because this is a big fish game, and it says it's a big fish. I now get it. Ha ha, very funny. Or punny. Okay, programming, okay. Now then, here are the photos down here. We only have one right now. That's programming, pay programming, uh, news, news, travel. The cat psychic, dog swap. Videos, Extreme TV, Dance Party, Mystery, I'm with Mr. Creeps, Lose 30 Pounds in 7 Days, Aerobics, Golf, Racing, Cat Sidekick, and Dog Swap. That has to be the funniest, though. It's locked. Oh, here. This is it. Uh, the time was 11.30. And he's got a lot of cash in here. Yeah, uh, that's not sketchy at all. Neither is the voice I gave him. And I ought to take a photo of this. Oh, and then nothing else there. This. And this is where we'll be putting these. Oh, yes. And that for outside. Wait. Do I have one? No, I don't. Come on, come on. There. Please. Just a little more. I'm going to have to dig up this grave. Oh wait, I have to solve the puzzle first before I can do it. I usually just kind of randomly do this and somehow end up solving it. See, completely random. Yeah, it's not creepy at all that he buried his puppet. I'm Mr. Creeps. That you are. You mind if I borrow this key card, Mr. Creeps? No? Because, yeah, you no. Know. Yay, key card. I'm still missing one of these. Where is it? Am I forgetting where it was? Already? Can we still go here? I can. I don't want to hear him talk again. Oh, 
Oh, and that is the timer. So, I guess that will do it for this episode. And I am always bad with intros and outros, as always. Uh, see you with the next thing of this game. And this is going to be hard to do because I have to... It's scream time! Wait, what? She's waiting for you, Kiara. Okay, what the F? No, 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 no. That's... How do you know that, you creepy puppet? Okay. I forgot that was a thing. But yes, now it is over uh, for this episode. I will see you next time, and bye for now.